only reason that I put strawberries and blueberries in today is because I've had like something similar with just the oats before for like I don't even know the last like couple of weeks with like variations of like eggs or something in between I had like a bit of extra flavor to it but I have about 10-15 minutes before I have to leave and obviously you can see that I'm still very low on energy <laughs> and let's just hope I'm not late Possibly tough session that I've been doing. Life of a semi-professional athlete, it is a bit dirty right now. But recycling this, filling it up with ice, using it as a drink bottle, that's probably been one thing that I've worked on. Which has like helped me be improving because I've ne never used to hydrate. It's pretty poor at eating to the point where I'd maybe have like breakfast, small lunch, and then like no, no dinner most nights. I'm trying to trying to work on my eating habits which has gotten better which I feel like is why I may have got a bit stronger but so far I've only done four reps got three to go and then we've got gym afterwards <sighs> oh, come on. stand next to me Trav shout out to your boy Shamar James we out here getting it yo what's up uh, it's your boy uh, Josh Cowley shout out to your, your boy Shamar James you know we're out here getting it yeah, um, you're grinding. Scenes. Yeah, we're grinding just like you. What'd you do today? Uh, we did the 20 second runs, you know, speed endurance. Yeah. Uh, you know, it was, it was tough. We're long jumpers. We don't run further than 40 what? meters, but, you know, Shem was pushing me. So, uh, yeah, shout out to his like, subscribe. <laughs> um, deuces. So tell everyone your name and your, your business uh, in case they don't know who you are. Josh Cowley. I'm a yep. long jumper. What'd you do this year or last year? Oh, uh, Yes, went to uh, Youth Olympic Games, grabbed myself a silver medal. In men's long jump, Joshua Cowley of Australia had won stage one with a jump of 7 metres 71. He went even further with this effort early in stage two. That was 7 metres. Silver medal? Why, why only silver? Um, it's better than your bronze. Yeah. Uh, okay. So. <laughs> I thought I said why though. <laughs> <laughs> uh, unfortunately, I got beaten by a Cuban. Oh. You know, that's how it is. It's just like World Juniors back in 2016. World Juniors? Oh, I didn't get that far. Trash! <laughs> uh, yeah, that's pretty much all I did. That was the highlight of my season. What'd you uh, jump? Uh, jump 782, right. so six centimeters shy of Shamai James PB. Oh, uh, that's the goal. He set the bar up there. Yeah, dog, and so it's a high nice. bar. No, what about yourself? Tell me something. Um, there's nothing really about me. Why not? I'm just here. Um, you grinding? Yeah, I'm grinding. Grinding for what? Uh, to come on. Make states. Make states. States. Yeah, make states. 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 You can make more than states, Trav. I set the bar. Set the bar a bit higher. State's final. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> you know what?
good luck in all your efforts. <laughs> Thank you for your features today. Good session. Thank you. Damn, look at this whip though. Show me how you drive off real quick. Hi. What tunes you got in here? You got an ox cord? Seatbelt on, safety first. Safety first, obviously. Now listen to this. Oh, oh, look at that. Oh. Look at that engine. Is that a Maserati? <laughs> oh, snap. Calm down. Oh. See you, Chevy Bucket. See you later. Did I? Did you, did you drop Yeah. Because yeah, he said, okay, I'm running into calls. <laughs> ship, ship, see me. So my bad, everybody. I didn't actually get to put up any, or get the camera set up for any of the gym sessions. Did a couple of lifts, 190, I think, on the single leg uh, squats and KGs, obviously. In Australia, did all these other like glute developing exercises, some quad strength and stuff, some upper body circuit, and now we're about to head home. My New Year's resolution, New Year, New Shemi. I decided to that everything was going to be trying to make my body a temple. It's so hard, so hard to make your body a temple with all these other damn temptations around. When I'm at work, all these lollies. All these candies, chocolates, all that good stuff, they're the access. And I'm trying to be like, Shem, no, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. Next thing I've ate, 18, and I got some stash in my pocket. I'm like, God damn it! Why y'all keep doing this to me? And yes, now y'all know who's eating all the lollies, everyone at work. I'm sorry. That was the old me. I've been good so far this year. I've already had a cheat day. I think it's I think it's fair to have cheat days. Um, notice I said days like plural because I've had multiple already. What day are we into the year? It's like, what, maybe 10 days into the year so far? Y'all yeah, should see where I'm about to, about to head. I'm driving real slow. I had to go, I had Aaliyah go pick up uh, slushy for me from McDonald's because I'm like, I need, I need the sugar. I was like, my leg, my, my whole body was shaking after all those runs. Like I did, I only got five done. I didn't even do like the bounding stuff afterwards because you know, your boy was too tired. But I need to go true to drive through real quick. I'm going to get McDonald's. I'm only getting, I'm not getting a meal because I got good stuff waiting for me at home. I just feel like I need some salt right now. So um, I saw there was a $1 large chips. I'm gonna get it real quick. Also like real quick, just let me know if you like these types of videos because I can do more like a day in the life type videos let you all know what's going on it, throughout the whole day for me as a semi-professional athlete and I'm not gonna switch over to the title of professional athlete until I do something amazing get the one dollar large chips from the from the app yep the other code uh yes I just want my McDonald's yeah hi there welcome to McDonald's that was all of it. <laughs> I'm still at the window. Wallet, wallet, he's sleeping in the streets. Shake it. I think one of these days I should just go around and do, because I'm obviously full Jamaican. Mama and dad are Jamaican. It's all with this one strand of dread. What is it? What is you doing, dreadlock? But I should go around one day and just try and hold my Jamaican accent towards people as long as I possibly can. See if they. See if they know. And like, at times, my Jamaican accent goes weak. Ah, uh, yes, please. 30, 40, 60, 70, outside. What a legend! Yeah, thank, thank you very much. I like this type of service, McDonald's. You get a five stars from me. My dude had it just holding out the window. Your boy didn't even have to slow down at all. And I'm gonna destroy these fries real quick on the drive home, obviously. I'm not gonna sit here any longer because I am hot. I started training at 8 o'clock. It is 1 11 p.m. I am tired. I want to sleep. LeBron probably doesn't even give a damn that I'm gone. But yeah, like I said, I should try, try to put my Jamaican accent on. I was, I was gonna say that 
with my accent. I'm like, sometimes it's like real fire. You'd probably think I'm just like some Jamaican dude that has like maybe gone, I don't know, gone abroad for like a couple years. Like he's still got the accent, but it's like, it's not like fully there. Sometimes it's not like that. It's like, I'll be talking, thinking I'm killing it. And then the next thing I say the most like Australian thing, like I was saying, I'm like, I'll go from being like the biggest road boy that Jamaica's probably ever seen. Ah, oh, come on, whatever, good enough. I'm about to end it in a second, but I'll probably go from being the biggest road boy, like we said, that doesn't count, that was pretty bad, to having like the strongest Australian accent that you could probably ever find in your life. And because it's like mixed in with a Jamaican accent, it like emphasizes it even more, which is annoying. I remember at Youth Olympic, the Jamaican dude that I uh, high jump against. I was like telling him that I was Jamaican. He's like, oh, really? And I was like, yeah, I can even say something. And I was like, Wagwan. 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 What you want? What you want? And he's like, you ain't gonna be from Jamaica to ask me what's going on. He's like, she's a fake. And I was like, oh. My lord. So I smacked him up real quick and beat him. Who really won? I did. And then I versed him in basketball the day after. It was myself and Joseph. He kept talking all this smack that he was really good at basketball. So I was like, obviously, I'm gonna have to challenge this dude real quick. Versed him. I didn't think he was amazing, but you know, I can't say nothing. He beat me like 11 to like three. I think. I don't know what was going on with their courts. I think the, there was a lot of wind when every time I shot it, so like my my shots weren't splashing like I wanted them to, but you know, it ain't no thing. I don't really give a damn. I'm not holding on to that, but like five years later, he can have that. Who's got the medal? I do. He can jump high now, but you know, I retired from high jump, so I went out with a bang and a medal. Kidding. Check this out as I turn into it. Watch my guy and how excited he gets. Oh, this is. Look at my guy. Hey, LeBron. You know, he tries to push his way through. And this is killing him right now that he can't get to me. Ready? Bark and just. Hey, buddy. that tail wagon I I think by far it's my favorite drink that has ever existed is that the lactose in it I can drink as much of this as I want to and it's delicious so I recommend anyone that wants to get Vita soy get them but not on my shop these things always run out so quickly uh, what am I trying to grab I'm trying to grab these so this is some dinner that I cooked the other other night I'm gonna have to eat it obviously the McDonald's wasn't enough all that I've done since we were last chatting was I just rested for a bit because I was exhausted. <sighs> I honestly felt like I was going to pass out, fall asleep. After I recovered a little bit, I started doing some music things. So I was like, just recorded two songs. I'm heading off to Melbourne today. I'm going to go visit my boy Darcy. See you soon, boy. Um, we I recorded that so that I had something to play around with. While I'm on the flight, like Gabby will probably fall asleep, most likely. So I'll stay up. I'm gonna edit, try and mix around with the beats. I want to try and make a music video today to one of those songs. So hopefully that can drop soon. If I actually record it, I'm just trying to. I'm in the planning stages. I know I am definitely eating a lot later than what I had planned to. It is about three o'clock right now. Probably should have like continued, like got some food into me more or less straight away obviously because of how much energy I burned off this morning um, that's why I felt like more because I, I already cooked it but like pasta energy boosting I got some tuna in there some I got a four bean mix or something like this I'll show you real quick put this put some veggies in it I put this four bean mix Pasta, obviously. Three tins of tuna. This is that. Someone got my Jamaican splashes. My little flat toy, you know. Gotta get some Caribbean 
Caribbean thing. You want to run fast, you got to put the Caribbean spices in there. I've been putting it in my whole life, still ain't fast. So. Music and making these videos are like some of my hobbies, so that's why it's good to have something to do when, when you get home. So this is like, this is my outlet from the athletics world is like doing music, doing videos like this. It's what keeps me sane and obviously like working as well. Um, I only work a couple times a week. The lo last two weeks I, I did do like five days each, each of those weeks. Um, so it's a bit tiring. Now that it's getting closer to competitions, I'd probably have to cut back to like my three, maybe two, I don't know. If you see this, um, you know who you are. Maybe even one. I don't know. We'll see. I, I, I'm at a good balance right now, so I think I can handle this this workload, and like it means that I'm getting a good amount of income coming in that I can live comfortably, save some money at the same time. I want to go eat. This is my food. This is my dog that is trying to steal all my food. I know he's going to follow me directly down the stairs as soon as I start walking. What he does is stares at my food and licks his lip like as if I'm gonna give him some. I'm like, you've been trying that for like three months now. I ain't giving you nothing, dog. But, okay, going downstairs, gonna eat. Uh, I'll touch back later. Eddie, you can't even see me. <laughs> you can't even see me. Where are we off to? Mother. You say it's all American like. Do I? Melbourne. Melbourne. Oh, I was supposed to say it. Melbourne. 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 Mel and Bun. Sound Australian? Melbourne. I'll teach you the language. <laughs> so all in all, that's been a day in the life of your boy as a semi-professional athlete. You train hard, kinda hard. You die a little bit, you sleep for a little bit, you eat a little bit, and then you fly out of the city. That just happens daily in my world <laughs> so we'll see you next time Deuces. <laughs>